Day nine. Very cloudy one at that. Today's an extra special day. We have just reached 2,000 subscribers, something I never thought was possible a year ago. So to everyone that has subscribed, big thumbs up. Thank you very much. Really appreciate the support. Now today, Connor's just sticking a brew on and we're going to start getting some floorboards screwed down in there. And when the floorboards are done, it means I get my architraves and I can get my architraves, my windows and doors finished. Leaving the roof today, that's a weekend job. We're working tomorrow and Sunday. Priorities, floorboards, architraves, possibly skirting. So tea time, crack on. Connor's got one of the main floors down. He also made a start on this one, but this is going to be a bonded floor, so you don't quite know where them boards are yet. He's made a start in the, the bathroom. It's going to eventually have a tiled floor, but we've just had a rather large lorry load of timber turn up that we've been asked kindly to unload. So Connor's going to be left over there unloading that, and I need to get all of the insulation out of that room because that's where I'm going to go next. probably thinking, Jordan, where's the rest of part nine? Lucky for you guys, you're getting part nine and part ten together. I'm going to explain why. We had a phone call during part nine to say there's a small timber delivery coming. I'm not going to be able to be there. Keys to the forklifter with it. Could you just help the driver get it unloaded? Won't take you long. Won't take you long was a bit understated was a 27 ton, 30 pallet load of timber. Now, we started unloading it with the forklift, we got one load off. Went to put it down, we got the forklift stuck. And I say stuck, it got beached. We tried to dig it out. I pulled it out eventually with the van. And then we went to go and get our next load off the lorry. And we got it stuck again. So I went over to the building site over there and they brought over a big machine and they pushed us out with the, the digger arm. And it turned out to be a six, half past six finish at night. And we couldn't get anything else done on the building. It was fun, it was different, not something I'd try again. But what I'm gonna do, I'm here on my own today. Hope you enjoy your lying, Connor. I'm gonna get the kettle on and I'm gonna continue where I was at in the building. Happy Sunday.
Another room, down, done, off the list, which means I'm moving on to this little room next. Shouldn't take as long because it's only small. Kettle's on, I'm gonna have a cup of tea and I'm gonna jump straight on that. Bathroom's off the list, which means I now get to try and work out the bond of this floor because it's about six different sizes to put down here. And I'm hoping that sun always up and works its way around here because it is freezing today. Again, I don't deserve this. Anyway, I'm going to have a quick bite because it takes a lot of calories to run a machine like this. And then I'm going to start moving some stuff, get this floor laid and then I can get onto my architraves, which I found. Yes, architraves. I've had a sift through, I've sorted out my sizes of my floorboards, I've had a tidy up, I've got a nice blank canvas to go at. I'm going to set myself a challenge and that is I'm not having a cup of tea until I get to that halfway point there. And the cup of tea I have after that is going to be right at the end. It's like a punishment reward system I've got going on myself. I've got to entertain myself somehow, I am on my own today. And it is a Sunday, most people are probably eating their Sunday dinner. I'm here eating sawdust. So I've got my floorboard sorted out. I've got my bond, I know where I'm going, rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat, bit boring, got to crack on with it, need to get it done, so Godspeed, let's get this floor down.
I'm over halfway. I was going to stop at halfway, but you know what sounds better than halfway? A little more than halfway, which means I've got a little bit less to do the second time round. And it also means I'm allowed to make myself a cup of tea. I'm going to treat myself. I've had a clear up. I'm leaving the last couple of boards out for the floor just in case the electrician wants to have a little inspection of what's gone in and out of there. And I solemnly swore to myself today that I will be getting some architraves on. So I've had a little sort out of the architraves so I know where, well, what goes where. I've also had a bit of a clear up because I think a messy site is a very disorganized mind. So tidied up, could be a little bit better. It will be by the time I leave here. While I could see everything in the light, I thought, good chance to, you know, get a few bits picked up. So, Architrave, I've got going on there. Architrave, I've got going on there. And can I just say, how beautiful is that sunset? Anyway, time to crack on, get these Architraves on, because it is one of my priorities for today. And I'm going to put some on. I've got to. The architraves should dement me no longer. I've made progress with them, I've made a start, I'm happy with that today. And I feel like I've done a fair bit myself today, quite surprised myself. But uh, yeah, it is now five o'clock on a Sunday. I'm gonna get wrapped up and I'm gonna head home because I've gotta to go to Tewkesbury tomorrow, to build a five by three. And then I'm heading back here. So you'll next see a video on Wednesday. So I look forward to seeing you. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe, turn your notifications on, preferences to all, and you'll be able to see the next part of this that comes out, which will be part 11. I'll see you guys in part 11.